Welcome back, and my name is Dad's Dad. Thanks for tuning in again. We are here back on Sector 17, and uh, yeah, why don't we go and uh, we'll check the stores, and I will kind of fill you in on what I've been up to. But before I fill you in, we have a handful of new additions to the Sector City that we are going to have to check out. I mean, take a look at that. Wow, I like that dome effect they put up there. Not sure what that is, but that is very cool looking. I really do enjoy this one as well. That is very cool looking as well. That's a good looking building right there. <laughs> anyway, let's run and check the stores. Um, we did actually have a build that was fully... Well, oh, there's some diamonds. Um, I actually fully built it and tore it down. I, I actually ended up not liking the placement of it and uh, just the way it looked surrounding everything else that was in Sector City. Um, so I, I took it down. Yeah, so it was fully built and... Um, I just took a town. It just really didn't uh, mesh with everything else in Sector City. Um, and I think I saw that looking out from the sand shop. We're going to go run and take a quick look at that. Um, I think I'm going to take a break from the shopping district area. I've kind of been neglecting the home base. And we will go home um i probably have a ton of oops probably have a ton of things that i need to clean up i got this bulker box mess going on this is not even the half of it oh, strange um we'll run over here and check the last couple stores and at home I grabbed every shulker box I think I had laying around the shopping district. And we are on our oops. We are on our way home here to uh clean up. So I scavenged the base and I rounded up all my shulkers and this is what we got a mess all of them have miscellaneous items in there random totals random things that's all of them so i think we know what is good for us we should probably get everything put away so let's uh let's go get started on that also, before we get too far in getting all this cleaned up, we made about a stack and a half of diamonds just from the shopping district. So we'll get those put away here safely and uh, we will go and get this process started. Um, I'm recording the Halloween here. And I, I don't think I've ever seen this before. But we have a zombie with a skeleton head. Or a pumpkin head. That's really cool. That's probably something Minecraft did for Halloween. But 
How cool is that, though, hon? That's really sweet. Grab all. Gonna grab all these here. I know we're out at the shop. The district go take care of that and get this mess started. Disgusted. This is horrible. Let's go. Mm. Why we were here, I thought. Eh, we might as well check out the uh, the new wishing well. You know, all this great work everyone's put into the shopping district. We might as well check it out. Oh, cold ore. Let's give it one more shot while we're here. Honey blocks. Nice. We'll add that to the collection of shulkers. Oh, that's pretty cool. Nice. It's a nice little build all together. Really nice looking. Alright. Let's go. Get this shulker mess cleaned up. I know that... JJ here has been working on a escape room for Halloween, which is today the day that I have been recording here. Um, so we're being saved by the bell, and we are going to go into the escape room and avoid having to do our shelter mess for a little while. So we will go and do that and see what that's like. It should be pretty fun. I'm excited. More pumpkin mod. Very, very cool. Oh, that one's got a lighted up head. Our zombie did not. All right, so this is not a good start. We have to get rid of everything. Yeah, and I've got all these levels. Twelve of them. <laughs> oh, yeah, I got eleven myself. Okay. Oh, I see why JJ changed his skin like that. Now he just looks like a flying... It's like bad. Go and right. click bed, die. Okay. Goodbye. <laughs> Uh. Oh, what the? Uh huh. Oh wow. It's cool that the spawn changes. Okay, let's read the book. In order to find the materials you need, keep your eyes on the light. Okay. You have awakened in a grimy cabin in the dead of night. You've been hiding from them for weeks. Your supplies are starting to dwindle, so you need a scavenge. Weak from dehydration, you can't open the heavy door. Drink some water to gain back your strength. In order to find your materials, you need to keep your eyes on the light. Well, there's materials in this chest here. Ah. Uh, wait, hold on. There's a barrel in there, but there's nothing in it. Okay. Eyes on the light. Did you hear that? Yeah. Eyes on the light. you got to point the eyes towards the light. Right? No. Hold on. Wait. Actually, check the barrel. See if there's anything in there now. The eyes are facing the light. Oh, oh we got coal. Coal. All right. Uh, furnace. Oh, we got what some we smelting? stuff in here. Do you think we... Huh? Drink water, it said, too. Oh, hold on, hold on. Uh, okay, the sand. Glass bottles. Ah, uh, okay. What do we... We're drinking from the cauldron. The cauldron's probably got a uh, observer at the back of it to see when something's taken. I'm gonna oh, guess. okay. So, 
It just needs to be. I kind of want to say, hey, just let us figure it out, but okay. Yeah. Uh, did you grab golden apples already? Yeah, there were six of them. I took half. How much bread did you take? Uh, 30. Oh, okay, so you took half more. Uh, a little less, but that's fine. We're... And I'm going to yank that extra piece of coal. We're seeing an abandoned gas station down the path. It's a small town, and you head off to loot some supplies. The hordes of zombies will soon engulf you if you are not swift. All right, we got to find a gas station. There's a sculpture over here. Is there? Of the ancient variety. There's an axe on this uh, log over here. Should we go with it? Yeah, take it. Okay, let's go to that gas station. Ah. Uh, oh, this is parkour. What about this side? Hmm. Ah, I found it. Oh, uh, you found what? <laughs> Dad, look up. Oh. There's a whole set of switches up here. There's a bunch of other things. Gas and go breaker. Alright, I got that written down. I may or may not have goofed with the levers already. But I think I put them back to how they were. Can you? Uh, what were the numbers you had? Can you come let me out? My bad. It's okay. Oh, hey, hey, hey. Okay, hold on. Oh, no, no, no. Run, 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 run. Okay, we're good. I'll take them off. I'm going to die down here. Grab them out. I got one. Okay. Nope. Let's just work together. Let's do this parkour together. Right here. Jump up. You got a shift jump, I think. Or I do control jump. I hear the. So, what did you write down? Uh, one, four, five, one, zero, two, two. And then we also have zero one zero zero one one zero one. So I'm guessing that's that's these zero one zero is all zero one zero one, one. zero zero one one zero one. Okay. What was the other one? It was a phone number almost. Oh, these are open. Uh, gas station seems mostly looted already. Any supplies you get here will be only the only you will have for weeks or months. So search every corner. These moldy Doritos seem fishy. Don't take them. I heard they keep the good stuff in the back rooms. I got a but key to the... a supply room. Okay. So you got a key to a, a room? Here's yeah, a supply I do. closet key hole. Here is the Office keyhole. You said don't take the moldy Doritos, but there are four of them and they're all facing a different way. And he said check every. Hold on. Hey, here's this sword. Eyes you get. Yeah, which key is that for? Supply room. So here's the supply closet right here. That's the keyhole for it. Oh, right there. 
grindstone, a barrel, and a compass. So must if there's anything in here. No, but did you hear that click? Even spookier with these uh, pumpkin-headed mobs. There are some pressure plates we need to find. Is there any of that back room we missed? No. Oh, right here, right here, right here. Is that one right? That's one right there. Oh, wait, there's one right here. Go into that room. Go ahead. Go step on that pressure plate again. Run in there. Okay. Oh, I didn't think about how you're going to get out. It's okay. There's a... Uh... I see is green, green, blue, green. This doesn't make any sense. Two in the green, one water bottle in the light blue in the middle, and then three water bottles. Yeah, see, this. You just gave me a bottle that said Viagra. Yeah, I've got one too. So, three in here. Two. That's what we tried. Three. One in this one. And then two in this one. How did you figure that out? Because it was, if you come back and look at the painting, you have two green blocks, but two levels of water. One blue block, one level of water, three of these other. So, I have to go back in here. Check the hopper. We got a key to the office that washed up in the sink. Okay, cool. How would you get that from the moldy Doritos? They're the only ones that spin on an item frame. This resembles an item frame spinning. To me, anyway. Maybe if I have a little Viagra. You got a five hour energy? Yeah. <laughs> All right. I think he was looking at it this way. Oh, I got it. I think. What'd you I think find? It has to do with these. <laughs> Oh, wait, 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 wait. Stop, 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 stop. Look at the ones that are blinking. Red. Red. Teal. Purple? Red, teal, purple, and... Blue. Blue. So then... It's red, purple, blue, teal. Purple. Okay. So it's going to be, you go to the first one okay. and make okay. it point to the left. Done. And then the second one's going to be bottom right. Okay. The third one's going to be bottom, or sorry, top right. Oh, hold on. Something just dinged. Oh, I know where one artifact is. I will go and get that. Right. That's the one here on the left. Then we need an emerald and a book. Okay, oh god. Got it. Both of them? Okay, the ancient gems in there. You already put the clay. You already put the clay. The last one is a I book. beat the game. What'd you do? Where'd you find it? No, I, I just fell through the map. Oh. <laughs> I 
on a shelf somewhere. Oh, uh, I found it. Where? There's a shulker in the oh. floor over here. <laughs> Jeez. <laughs> oh, hold on. Bombs away. Oh, this is very dark down here. Uh, let's kill the skeleton real quick. Uh, we gotta fix a valve outside. Find a tool. Some of, the, some of the pipes in the lab may need repair as well. We may place some break blocks in here to craft ingredients for the cure. Do not block off areas from zombies or break puzzles. Don't place water on the floor directly. Then we can build. Oh, this is how zombies come in. This is nothing for us. It says that we can build a pipe, though. You have a cash register. Iron. Ah, uh, I got a wrench. What else do we need for that cure? A bone block. Oh, I got ten bones. I, I don't think that's how we're supposed to do it, but that works for me. Um, for here. Oh wait, give me that. Give me that tool. I'll go turn the water on. Where you at? Here, right here. Where's, There's a way where'd to, you turn to turn it on outside. On? Is there? Yeah, that's what it says in this book here. All right, water valve should be on. Yep. Oh, yep, we got water. Oh, uh, okay, I think I got it. Wait a second. All right, yeah, this is it. No, that's something else. Flip that again. I think we need to get the water right here. Okay, hold on. Each one does something different. Some of them do nothing at all. No, there isn't, JJ. I've flipped all of them, I promise. And here we are. Ah, unfortunately, something came up and I was unable to finish the escape room. But um, we are cutting the episode, ending it uh, with the project that we thought we were going to complete here. Um, we'll save that for next time, right? Right? Anyway, my name has been Dad's Dad. Thanks for watching the video, and I hope you guys enjoyed JJ's escape room. He uh, he put a lot of work into it and did a, a great job, I think. So um, props to him. It was very fun to play. Uh, like, subscribe, do whatever you got to do. Uh, we'll see you guys in the next episode.